seeing this area being pushed forward with women researchers and women on Vanguard. Um, one of the examples uh, that, that comes to mind is Amy Beckley, who's one of the um, two founders of the Prove Progesterone Test. And she had experienced recurrent miscarriages and difficulty conceiving and maintaining a pregnancy. She ended up with expensive IVF treatment, which resulted in her child. And then she found later that she suffered from low progesterone. And after addressing this issue, she was able to easily uh, conceive and maintain a pregnancy and had her next child naturally in that way. And she, looking back at her experience, was um, disappointed that this relatively easy test and treatment um, didn't get to her until after she'd been through all, all that she'd been through. And so women like her have been disappointed with the status quo and have pushed for better tests, who are pushing for better knowledge and pushing for more women's empowerment are really making a huge difference um, for everybody. Yeah, um, it's so incredibly exciting. And what was once kind of unattainable information, I'll bet go into the doctor's office, we can now gather, gather that data at the comfort of our home. So whereas, you know, for example, going to a lab to have your blood drawn and analyzed to check for the progesterone level. Now, as you mentioned, Amy Beckley has created an at-home test where at a certain threshold you could um, see if progesterone reaches that threshold um, in your body in a specific time of your cycle. So very, very empowering. You're absolutely right um, that, that we are being able to be um, I don't know if the word is controlled, but empowered. I like that word, empowered by we know what we need to know. Now we can know <laughs> what we need to know um, at the convenience of our home, which, yes, very, very exciting. 